Hey Cancer, welcome to your weekly reading for July 5th to the 11th. My name is Johanna, welcome to Tenacious Soul. We are going to go through some general messages for you guys for the week, so take what resonates, leave the rest. You can always check out your sun, your moon, and your rising sign. You guys can also follow me on Instagram, the link for that is down below. I post different readings over there, as well as... Um, Sorry, I'm just looking at the cards here. Um, yeah, different readings over there, pick a cards, all that kind of fun stuff. So if you're interested in that, the link for that is in the description box, okay? So I'm using the Goddess Power Oracle. We have Salvation in the Upright. We have Adaptability in Reverse. And we have Flow in Reverse. Interesting. You're trying to hold on to something. I'm trying to hold on to something. We have beauty in reverse here. Um, so I'm kind of getting that um, it's like you're trying to, to save something or you're trying to make something work, but it's, it's not, there's no flow. It's like you're not wanting to change is what I'm getting cancer. And it's like, you're trying to hold on to something that doesn't really look good anymore, the beauty in reverse. It's like, it's not, it's not working for you anymore, even though you're holding on to it. We have high honor that has come out here with the Lenormand deck, uh, which is the Kipper fortune telling deck. And we have main female. So I feel like you're being called in a new direction here. Um, that I don't know it's like you're trying to hold on to something and if anything like I feel like if there's a new opportunity here for you I feel like it's really good like I feel like you're being recognized or it's like it's saving you from the past but some of you ha are really like not wanting to be in flow or move towards this change like you're really wanting to kind of hold on to something or you're just worried that it's maybe not going to come towards you so let's kind of see what the tarot has to say for you cancer what does the tarot want to say all right cancer for the week what do they need to know spirit we have the eight of swords in the recent past with justice and the King of Cups. Current energy, we have the Eight of Pentacles. We have the Nine of Cups. And we have the Tower. Near future, we have the Ten of Cups. We have the Magician. And we have the Page of Cups. Bottom of the deck, we have the Seven of Cups. Um, yeah, there's like some illusion or like feeling kind of like stuck or you definitely have been feeling stuck with the eight of swords here in the recent past. I do. You are manifesting happiness and wish fulfillment. Something that's better for you. Um, in the recent past here, we have the eight of swords. We have justice and the king of cups. Like this is like. Being stressed about the outcome of something. I feel like a lot of you, there's something here where some of you are manifesting like a relationship or some sort of, I feel like it, something comes in unexpectedly. Like I feel like you're focused on other things possibly this week um, or distracted by something that, I don't know, something unexpected comes in. But in the recent past, there was some sort of like, justice restored in a situation because I almost see the king of cups is like celebrating so something you were worried about in the past I feel like has um I don't know it's like you've conquered it or you've like had some sort of justice be restored in a situation <clears throat> and that's in the recent past your current energy with the eight of pentacles the nine of cups and the tower some of you are working on your happiness or something unexpectedly that's like a wish fulfillment i feel like could come in and i feel like it's unexpected because you're working on other things with the eight of pentacles like you could be even focused on work this week um 
but unexpectedly I feel like there's some sort of change that comes in and for a lot of you it's a manifestation of because I feel like with this nine of cups I'm really getting like a single energy or like being focused very much like on yourself um and I feel like in the near future, this manifestation, there's some sort of like offer here with this page of cups that I feel like can lead to the 10 of cups here. And I feel like you're manifesting it. And I don't know if it like unexpected, unexpectedly comes in because that's kind of what I'm feeling. Some of you have been like not sure you've been stressed about relationships or getting into a relationships. But I feel like somebody is going to be realizing or noticing you even but it's like you have to just kind of go with the flow is kind of what I feel like I feel like some of you have maybe been trying to like force a situation with the tower here and the magician it's like you have to allow the universe to kind of like do its work you know and do what it needs to do all right let's see I want to see what this eight of swords is in the recent past for you cancer What's this Eight of Swords in the recent past for Cancer? Eight of Swords in the recent past. Queen of Pentacles. And the Five of Pentacles. Some of you are stressed about money too. Or just like worried about like being alone even. For some of you, like there's a bit of like an abandonment um issue there of like am i always going to be alone am i going to find kind of like my partner that i'm looking for what's this justice card yeah the devil am i going to be stuck in karmic situations i feel like you have a decision here you had a decision here in the recent past to again restore karma this is the judgment card here so had a decision or the ability to restore karma in a situation could have involved another water sign or an earth sign but I feel like you you moved on from this which I actually feel like caused a victory for you like I feel like successfully you completed you restored karma in a situation here where I don't know if like yeah I feel like you were in your head about leaving something behind but I do feel like we have the hermit here so it's like you you're on your own What's the tower here for in the current energy for Cancer? Queen of Swords. There could be like communication coming in from someone unexpectedly. Give me one more here. Wow, that was like a lot. For a lot of you, there's a new opportunity that comes in and I feel like, I feel like a lot of you walked away. A lot of you aren't wanting to invest into um, situations where they're not balanced or they're, you're not being put first, you know? Make sure I got all the cards here. Oh. Interesting. What is this? Give me one on this Queen of Queen of Swords here with the Tower, please. Just one, please. Or two. Okay, we have the High Priestess and the Judgment again. Yeah, like you're you. I think you cut somebody off. That was that Tower moment. What's this Eight of Pentacles? You definitely made the, the decision. You guys are focused on work or something like some sort of project, even just like doing the mundane tasks, you know, like some of you are really just focused on your daily, your daily life to kind of like, like work through this energy. I feel like a lot of you are focused on things that fill up your own cup. Clarify the nine of cups. I feel like a lot of you like cut somebody off though here. And I think you're starting to like almost realize your own value as well in this process. We have the four of cups. Yeah. Like, Whatever wasn't making you happy, I feel like you're trying to find the thing that makes you happy. You're focused on your goals, your aspirations, things that like are for you, you know? What's this uh, magician in the near future here? Two of Swords, Knight of Cups. Yeah, there's somebody coming in here quicker than you think. Yeah, Knight of Swords again, Four of Wands. This is somebody who you could end up in a relationship with. Clarify this page of uh, Cups here. What's this page of cups? 
clarify the page of cups here four of wands there's going to be somebody here that i feel like you either don't know or they're at a distance from you there's some sort of like separation between the two of you that i feel um someone's going to come in and want to like get together with you clarify the ten of cups we have the death card you could be dealing with a scorpio give me uh one more for this ten of cups nine of pentacles yeah you guys won't be single <laughs> that's what i'm getting you won't be single for long what is the advice here oh boy two of pentacles what is the advice here nine of wands ace of wands i feel like your advice is like there is like a new a new opportunity coming in here for a lot of you in the near future. Because um, even if you're ending a relationship, I see you manifesting something new. You just might not like, you know, there might be a, some sort of like an illusion around like how quick that's going to happen. I feel like it's going to happen quicker than you think. Um, but I do f see that you guys are ending something here. But I feel like your advice here is to like, tie up any loose ends when it comes to just like your life in general like focus on getting things done restoring balance and harmony into your practical world whether that's like paying bills or like getting projects done or cleaning your house or like whatever that is I feel like there's an element of like getting that done so that you're ready for this new opportunity a lot of you are also like there is going to be res balance restored by ending this cycle this nine of wands this like thing that you've been hanging on to there's going to be something new and you kind of have to make the choice like are you going to hang on to it or are you going to move to something new i've been getting that a lot lately for just like the collective in general like what are you holding on to that needs to go um so i feel like because i feel like there's possibly conflict here I feel like the person from your past isn't happy that you're moving on. Five of Swords, the Emperor, the Six of Cups, and the Ace of Pentacles. The person that you were dealing with in the past isn't happy, so they may be trying to hold on to this situation, but it's almost like this, this situation that is changing. Like, I feel like it just wasn't working anymore with beauty reverse, flow in reverse, adaptability in reverse. Like, things weren't growing, things weren't expanding. And it's like you almost have to set yourself free from this. So I see you guys kind of like removing something or cutting something out of your life. And I feel like the universe is going to bring in an opportunity for you because you're being like put in this like high honor position where it's like they're recognizing the effort and the energy um, and the changes that you've done in your life. We got some good money cards here too. Like... I feel like if you're focused on abundance or like building up your abundance, we got the Queen of Pentacles, the Nine of Pentacles. I did see the Empress. We have the Eight and the Three of Pentacles. So the hard work that you're putting in is you are going to get recognized for that. The Ace of Pentacles is here too. So like some of you, this is like a new career, but you're definitely ending something and moving into something else. So that is what I have for you cancer hopefully that's helpful for you guys for the week so let me know down below uh, if not you can check out your other signs and you can always follow me on instagram for some other readings as well okay so i hope you guys have a wonderful day wonderful week and i'll see you guys in the next video okay